This residential property is situated on a narrow lot with extensive landscaping in the back of the home. Either the custom shape Havahart wireless fence or the Havahart fence-free underground wired fence will be the optimal solution, and here is why. When factoring in the property's narrow lot dimensions and extensive landscaping in the back of the home, the Radial Shape 2 Havahart wireless fence will not be the optimal solution. The radius of the fence will either intersect into the owner's home or encroach on the neighbor's property, allowing the dog to roam into their yard or on the roadway. The landscaping in the back of the home can present challenges as well. The dense landscaping can obstruct or interfere with the wireless signal strength of the controller. This obstruction or interference is known as attenuation of the radio signal or trigger zone. The part of the trigger zone that is obstructed by an object may bow or dip inward toward the controller. The system will provide a consistent boundary. However, bowing or a dip in the fence boundary can be caused by these elements. The narrow lot and dense landscaping create a restrictive roaming area for the dog, limiting his freedom of movement. These elements will not allow the Radial Shape 2 wireless fence to be used to its full capabilities. The Custom Shape Havahart wireless fence will provide the dog with the maximum roaming area for this property in a wireless system. The bases should be placed in the four corners of the home, but in a location where they are at least 20 feet from the desired fence boundary. By placing the bases in this manner, the issue of attenuation is minimized as there are fewer objects to interfere with the wireless signal communication between the bases and the fence trigger zone. Heavy metal objects inside the home and outside the home, such as an air conditioning unit or an electrical junction box, can affect signal strength. Make sure the bases are located at least three feet from these objects. You can customize the fence to meet the individual needs of your property. An added feature of the custom shape Havahart wireless dog fence is the flexibility to create up to four exclusion zones to keep the dog from entering different sections of the property within the fence boundary. Some examples of exclusion zones would be a landscaped area or a pool. The custom shape Havahart wireless dog fence allows for the expansion of the dog's trigger zone to all corners of the property. If you find that a wireless fence system is not the best solution for your property, Havahart also offers the Fence Free System, an underground wired fence solution that can easily and efficiently be used on any property type. With the Fence Free System, you design the boundary shape to work around any natural or permanent objects in your yard to create the maximum roaming area you want for your dog. Freedom for him, peace of mind for you.